are fighting a war 30 years in the future. Our enemy is not human. We need you to fight. This is a film about people living in present day who are drafted to fight a war that's happening in the future. I play Dan Forrester, who feels like he's destined to do something extraordinary. Dan's a, a family man just trying to get by and do the right thing. It takes this global event for Dan to realize his destiny. I'm not a hero. I'm just trying to save my daughter. The draft is taking people out of their everyday lives to be soldiers, most of whom are not equipped to be soldiers. The idea of a bunch of ordinary people who the audience could relate to seemed really interesting. Anybody can get drafted, like anybody. Bus drivers, truck drivers, it's a real gumbo of, of people. That everyday people are having to fight. I found it really exciting. What you think you know about basic training does not apply. You will not march, crawl, or climb. Oh, I was kind of looking forward to that. Dan does have combat experience, but he's surrounded by a lot of people who do not, and he sees it as his responsibility to try to get them through the war. How do you know how to do all this stuff, man? Long story. Be yeah, ex-military? Yeah. Kind of a short story, I guess. My character, she's a total badass, and her job is to help recruit soldiers to fight the war. We are ready, but very reluctant. Why don't we have pictures or videos that you know, would help us to know what we're up against? The consensus was if the public saw what they face when they reached the future, it would become virtually impossible to fill that hanger. Next time someone asks that, you should probably just lie. There's something really fun, vibrant, exciting in the idea that these are regular people being thrust into battle with this overpowering alien force. Everything. Hello. Hello. This and I don't care about the show. I just want a good blooper reel. I want to learn science. science. <laughs> you guys are going to make me look like I'm in the show, right? You're going to put in the effects. Replace the green. I don't want to look like an asshole here. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs>